hi guys welcome back to esp.net mvc tutorial i am ashish so this is part 41 of this video series before proceeding please watch part 40 in order to know about how to send multiple checkbox ids to the controller okay so now in this tutorial i'm going to discuss about how to create a responsive sortable photo gallery with jquery in esp.net mvc so basically what i'm going to do is i'll just display some images in a certain sequence okay and then I'll I'll just change their sequence by tracking and dropping facilities so it's gonna be very interesting videos so keep watching okay so before starting do subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed so let's get it started so here in the previous video I have created this example to send the IDs of these checkboxes to the controller so let's have the view of it so here you can see when I check this this and I I just want to send uh, the selected checkbox IDs to the controller so when I click update item then I'll just receive uh, all the IDs with uh, by comma separated okay so here you can get all the comma separated IDs into array by splitting it through comma okay so function F10 you can see so here I got all the IDs of selected checkbox okay so now let's fulfill our today's mission so first of all you just need to download the latest version of jQuery UI okay so here you can see when I extend this script folder you can see I have uh, jQuery UI when I see the version I can see version 1.12.1 .1. okay so so first thing is to do is to go to jquerydui.com slash download and just select the latest version 1.12.1 .1 and click on the download button okay so you will have the downloaded file here so I already have downloaded this and when you extract it you will see certain files okay so first thing is to do that just copy these files CSS files into your content folder see I have already copied and then just copy these two script file JS file to the JS folder see script folder okay I already have copied okay and then the third step is to copy these images into contained then image folder okay then you are done okay so now we'll try to use we'll, we'll try to display some images okay so first of all I'll just delete all the unwanted code okay so that's done okay so first step to take a list on order list okay and inside this you can take list okay now give a class class equal to as usual list group then every list will have list group item class and inside that you can have a div and then you will take you will drop the images so I'm just going to take some images see music not that see vocal I'm just tracking and dropping here okay and I'll just give see class equal to IMG responsive okay and also every list item should have extra class that is let's see call MD4 okay 
so let's copy this one two three four five and then five is okay or want to display one more okay so let's give an ID let's see short table gallery okay see after downloading uh, the jQuery UI you have to give this reference also okay so I have just given the jQuery references it's already done and then UI theme dot min CSS UI dot min CSS and then UI min dot JS okay so you can give the reference in the same way in your layout page okay now sortable gallery then image responsive 4 and now let's change the image let's say violin okay uh, I'll just copy change the image okay and let's see website website dot jpg okay and then I'll have one two more image see tabla so here I'll just take tabla is it jpg yes and now show shell show shell dot jpg okay and now one more music then online book store see Let's copy this and delete down okay if you see mobile.jpg okay so I have taken six images so let's try to refresh our UA and let's see what's gonna happen here so it's v it's very very simple see here you can see uh, I just need to remove this image uh, it is at third position I think one two three let's delete this column all image should have uh, you know equal size see okay so this is my gallery and now see this is arranged in a sequence see one two three four five six okay now I'll just change it position by dragging and dropping facility so see how it could be possible so just copy the IDs of this UL list and write a simple code that is hash id dot sortable that's all about the sorting image let's see see I'm able to change the position wow it's good see now it should be at first position and I just want to arrange it at second okay so this is draggable wow and now I 
we'll just give it give it style style cursor just change the cursor colon move okay so you can have the moving cursor now here you can see the draggable cursor see and now the benefit is that when you change the position of the particular image see then this this function get calls sortable and here you can also update see there is a update field you can call a function here let's see alert okay and display any message wow now refresh it now when you change its position see and drop it this function gets called and wall see so if you want to send the if you want to perform any action if uh, when when this sequence are changed then you can call this function in this way okay so you will have a list see when you inspect this element you will see that the this UI let's see uh, right now the f at the first position we have online book store image okay in the first li okay now change the position you will see that this list sequence is updated so when you see the first now you will see the focal image okay so one thing you can do is that uh, if these sequence are changed then this method will be called okay so you can loop through uh, the jewel items each items and you can perform any action okay so in this way you can create a gallery which is movable or you can say which is shortable okay see so jQuery UI is very powerful utility you can say and uh, you can get the advantage you can include uh, this jQuery UI in your project and you can get the huge advantage you can get the good look and feel okay so that's all for the today and uh, if you have any query then you can drop your comment into comment section okay so I think I have covered this and in the next video will uh, will provide you more and uh, thank you very much for watching my videos and if you like it then give a thumbs up and uh, share share this video among your friend and help them too okay so thank you very much have a great day